Today is May 4th, 2019, and at last my room is basically finished. The most important parts are done, which were painting the walls in this beautiful budgy blue and painting the trim in white, getting the new desk, which I got at Ikea, and I love that it has a pretty blue metallic lid. Those are so neat. And all this because of my new computer. The new computer did not fit on the old desk. And the old desk is really a sad thing. I didn't want to get rid of it, but it was had damage and was breaking down, unfortunately. But I love all the new glowy stuff, the keyboard, the blue computer. So this, these uh, closet doors are going to get repainted into white because they look terrible right now, although uh, things it works as a nice background thing stand up. And I got this new Vertigear gaming chair, which I might review later on. I'll just say this. It looks awesome. I love how it looks, but it's hard as a rock, and I've been trying to break it in for over a week now. All right, we got the section for the new pets. We got Minion playing in his little bell toy. Hello, Minion. I see you in there. And then down here we got Nautica who has learned how to drink water. She's so cute. It's early in the morning. I gotta change their bowls out and feed them and clean them still. And then this down here is not gonna stay. This is temporary. I plan to put some kind of uh, hard surface down there to make that into a shelf. That way the food's not on the ground and all their supplies and newspapers and things like that can go under there for easy access. Have the footstool so that I can sit and watch them and play with them. Or, because I'm short, I can stand on it and reach them when they try to escape onto the play gym where I can't get them. And then on this side, we've got the art desk. And I have to put the shelf back. And Chris will help me with that. I really, really need that shelf to have all my books and stuff off of the work table. I'd rather not have anything on this work table. I love this. I might get a second chair for this. Oh, and I am also planning to either tile the floor or uh, do linoleum or something. And maybe, some, maybe have some kind of cool art print on there. I don't know of what yet, maybe something of water or a space scene to make it look like you're walking on air, literally. And the bookshelves, what I plan to do with these is, um, well, painting didn't work. As you can see by the, the terrible job there on the, uh, that blue shelf, it's a gorgeous color, but... Um, it doesn't take this fake plastic siding on this is really slippery and, and paint doesn't stick to it. I even got that really expensive special primer that says sticks to everything. No, apparently it doesn't stick to these kinds of bookshelves. So what I'm planning to do is get some colored contact paper or wallpaper and uh, paper them up. Hopefully that will work, but I would like to make one that nice blue there as my favorite color and make this second one make it a, a nice lime green since uh, blue green and pink are my favorite colors as a, I am an 80s child and I love lots of color in everything I don't know why I was into this whole black thing in my 20s but uh, it was that whole modern look back in the 90s of black and white. I like the white now, but I've come to realize that the black sucks because, well, as you can see, or you can't see, you can't see anything. All this stuff vanishes. 
and it sucks all the light out of the room, which I like having lots of light and things being bright. Isn't that right, Nautica? She's commenting as she plays with her bird kebab. You know that big uh, storage shelf behind the PC back there? That's actually going to go over here. Again, with this being such a small room, it's going to be really hard to pull that off, and it's probably going to eat all the space up that's right there. So that's the plan for that. And then that should free up the space over there so I can open the closet door, because as of right now, that door does not open. And the walls, I puttied and fixed every single hole in here. And you guys know I had my Jurassic Park posters up there. I love posters. I love pictures and things on walls. <laughs> but yeah, I don't feel like poking holes after fixing all the walls now. And uh, I hope that uh, the plan, the plan for this big wall is that I am going to paint a really awesome drawing up there of my character, Fear. I don't know if I can do it. I'm a digital artist. I draw on paper first, and then I uh, scan it, and then I color it in on the computer. And That's like what you see there on the monitor. I make this beautiful digital art, and how I made the hood of my Jeep. But I would like to try painting. I've never been good at it, but I would like to have something permanent on the wall. That way I don't have to hang pictures. So my ambitious project is to do that as a practice for something small and then try to turn the master bedroom into scenes from Jurassic Park. I really, really want to do that. And that would all have to be uh, painted as well. And I'm not a good painter. I hope I can do it. Lastly, I'm kind of liking this whole doorless thing. I was losing a lot of room trying to measure out how big I needed of a table here because I had to count for the size of the door. And I've never liked the door because it's that ugly dark wood like the one on Chris's room over there. And the same color as the ugly closet. I love how the trim turned out and everything. But um, the of course the only problem is that if there's a sound going outside of the room, like in the living room or something, I won't be able to close the door. Um, and I was going to buy a new door and paint the door and put artwork on that as well. So it's still an option, but I'm just unsure of what to do. I, I rarely ever close the door, so as far as soundproofing goes, I'm not sure um, if... I, I kind of leaning towards that I don't need the door and I don't want the door and I like it being open. But yeah, the problem is for those few times that I need it quiet in here, it's going to be an issue not having a door. So unsure at the moment. So that is the new room. Still a lot of work to do. But the main stuff is done and it's livable.